Using TT's Microsoft Excel plugin, you can pull real-time data from the TT platform into your spreadsheet to view information and perform analysis. TT's Excel integration also gives you the ability to link values from your spreadsheet back into your trading interface to create visual indicators or to dynamically update parameters in your custom algos. Let's build a spreadsheet to track our net position in 10-year U.S. Treasury bonds across both the eSpeed and BrokerTech exchanges. We have a workspace with market grid and position widgets, as well as MD traders for each of our instruments. We'll begin with our sample spreadsheet. As you can see, the example formulas in Excel, referencing the user-defined exchange and instrument name in the top two rows, are using the available RTD fields listed in column A to request data from the TT RTD formula engine through the Excel add-in. The data is then displayed in our spreadsheet. Let's first pare down our spreadsheet to just the necessary information. We'll remove extra columns since we're only looking to track two instruments. If we scroll down through all the instrument fields which can be requested from the RTD formula engine under the single account filter heading, we see net position and average open price. Let's delete the rest of the rows, leaving the two fields we need and our instrument identification rows. Our instrument ID is requested using the equals RTD formula, which takes five parameters. Our first is the name of the server, tt.rtd. The second parameter is the name of the external server running the RTD server. As the TTRTD server always runs locally, you must omit a value for the second parameter. We then identify this request as inst. The next parameters are the exchange and the instrument name. For these values, we will reference the corresponding cells above. To find proper exchange and instrument names, we click on our instrument in our market grid widget and press Control shift x we see our instrument name in the table in the row labeled name and our value for the exchange in the row labeled market. Once we enter these values into their cells, our RTD formula returns the instrument ID that the formulas below use to request details about that instrument. Since these formulas filter by account, we also need to provide the account that we are using. So we will type account equals 12345E. Our formulas for net position and average open price use the instrument ID retrieved from the formula above. We also reference cells for the account name we are filtering by, as well as the field name we are requesting. Now that we have our data, we are going to enter formulas to aggregate our net position, as well as determine which average open price should be used. With the average open price identified, we can now display a laser line within our MD traders on the static price ladder at the appropriate price level. We click on the cell in Microsoft Excel that contains the desired value, and then right-click to select Copy to TT. We then right-click in MD Trader to select Paste Link from Excel. We can now see a laser line at the calculated price. We can also modify the cell color in Excel to change the color of the laser line in MD Trader. As our aggregated net position and average open price changes, we can see that our laser line moves accordingly. Due to its power and ease of use, Microsoft Excel has become a very important tool for many traders. TT's Microsoft Excel add-in allows you to combine Excel's analytical power with TT's Go Anywhere trading interface. For more information, visit our website at tradingtechnologies.com.